Hey everybody, it's PJ and the puppies. The puppies are in for a very exciting new adventure today. And they're probably gonna hate it. <laughs> so they are meeting the Roomba, which Jade has been hiding under her legs because Landon keeps wanting to turn it on. Um, do not let them on the carpet because I don't want them to pee on the carpet. Normally I would move the carpet. What, Joey? All right, you can turn it on. What is that? Well, I don't seem to really care. Um, Jay, 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 that puppy's getting close to. Hi. You bring the puppy back over here. What? <laughs> Landon likes the Roomba. So getting them used to a vacuum cleaner. We have a other, or like a stand-up vacuum cleaner too, but this is just what we want is them. That's okay. That's okay. He can turn it on. Landon loves the Roomba. It's like it's one of his favorite things. Yeah, that's just what we want. They pretty much could care less. Yeah, I know. You love the little look. Mm -hmm. Well, that's just what we wanted. They really could have cared less about that. So every day it's something new they get introduced to. Dave and I have a big list of all the things we want to try and get to over time. Rachel's checking it out. Puppy's feet, wash puppy's feet. Are you gonna come say hello? Come here. <laughs> Rachel's. There we go. I don't even know that the puppies realize that Lacey's in here. <laughs> Rachel just... Rachel just crawled under Landon's legs. Between his legs. Gentle with Joey. Gentle with Job. I lost my puppy. There she is. One of them realized mom was here. Are you trying to go in the car seat? That's Michael's car seat. So they're starting to take a little, I wouldn't say they're running yet, but they're definitely starting to get a little faster. Mason, keep them off the carpet. Um, they are about seven pounds now. Joey's getting close to eight, but they're all over seven pounds now. Uh, they're able to go to their new homes at eight weeks. Um, Jade and I are talking about whether this, we've, we've told this, the new owners for this letter eight weeks. We may next time make it 10 weeks. Um, so, <laughs> Shelly says the wheelbarrow was scarier. It was. They really don't seem to care about this. Hi. Reach. <laughs> Even with a brand new human baby, puppies are still puppies. The brand new baby is sleeping right now. <laughs> Does mommy have the puppies? 
Uh, Landon loves the puppies. I didn't even have a good job. Kissing <laughs> them. Um, so this is in the house. Yep, that's part of their training is they have to be exposed to new, everything new. So, you know, outside, inside, all around. Um, I don't think I will ever put them on carpet, though. Other <laughs> new owners are going to have to deal with that. Uh-oh. No, come back. See that? Yeah. This way. Here he comes. Mom. What? You said you never put them on carpet, but I mean, they're basically raised on carpet. Yes, I meant on my carpet. I meant, like, I'm not taking them. So, all different experiences. But... And you'll see sometimes they swarm around me. Here they are swarming around Brett. So that's that's a really good sign. Like if, if all they ever did was come to me, if all they ever did was come to me, then I would probably start to, um, you know, I, I would I would introduce a whole lot more people to make sure. Uh, where's the new baby? Can I show him? There's Michael. He's sleeping. Mason! Mason's going out to take care of food. Come here! Mama's got puppies. coming? No. Robin says I like 10 weeks seems to be better puppies from my experience. Yeah, I, I definitely not disagreeing with you. Um, what I will probably do is give people an option, uh, to be honest. Hello. Hi. People say you look good. <laughs> What's the matter, Phoebes? Now, one thing that's interesting you'll notice is the puppies aren't going crazy with Lacey being here. Like, they're not trying to, to follow her around. And <laughs> you have the vitamin D. You have the vitamin D. You can't have that one. Where'd their toy go, Jade? On the table. Good place for a dog toy. Here's somebody crying. Carpet. Oh, my carpet! Oh, my carpet! They don't trust you yet. They don't trust you yet. Did you bring back the puppy pads or no? for a walk. Well, I would say introducing them to the vacuum was a huge success. You know, that's what you want. You don't want to see them all scared of it. If they were scared of it, we'd take it away and then introduce it on another day. Where'd the toy go? You can feed in here if you promise to clean it up. I'll clean it up. Did you get your toy? Oh, it's not to be yet. Watch that. Did you get your toy? Ah, uh, yeah, it's raining out. Who wants to play with the toy? No, you want to snuggle. Yeah, you no. want to snuggle. No. <laughs> No. <laughs> Do you need help? <laughs> no, I figured it out. <laughs> just that everything's numb. I don't think so. <laughs> oh. 
Left my carpet. Boo puppies. Um, you. This is not land and food. This is puppy food. Oh yeah. Here you go. <laughs> How is the new puzzle coming? The puzzle's coming along well but slowly because it's gotten warm out and so it's pool time and so instead of doing puzzles, we're spending more time in the pool. Monica, you gonna come eat? Here puppies. Yes, the new baby's Landon's brother. Monica, come here, baby. You're going the wrong way, little one. Come on. It's dinner time. Is that a better ratio of me? Okay. Yeah. Um, Penny says, what would you estimate their grown weight to be? Probably between 70 and 100 pounds would be my guess. Um, it wouldn't surprise me if they got bigger than that, but, but that's my guess. So they're, they're now on four times a day eating. Yeah, we still have to feed them one more time. One more time tonight. Lacey's under the table cleaning up. And when we say cleaning up, we mean eating everything. <laughs> so cute when they sit. Yeah, it is cute. They look very different. Yes. Yeah, neither, and the reason I say 70 to 100 is because neither you don't want any more? Um, Castle or Beckett are on the huge end, are on the high end of their weight range. Yeah. So that's why I say 70 to 100. As opposed to Beckett, no, who no, is, no. you okay, puppy? No, buddy. You okay, baby? Um, yeah, it's not for you. As, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Sit Milk down. and raw. Puppies. Yeah, why don't you just pick him up? He's, he's just gonna go in there. You wanna sit with Dona? You wanna come over by me? Sit with Dona? You wanna come sit by me? <laughs> yeah, I know. Ugh. Um, yes, there's a photo of them sitting on the line on their website, actually. Yeah, yep, there's still the raw beef in there. Slash puppies? Yes. Jiva starts on slash puppy. Oh. Puppy, sorry. Okay, Jade. <sighs> Landon's had it for the day. He got a pretty he got a pretty short nap in today and not a good one. Touch, Landon. Come here, you want to sit on my lap? Why don't you take him outside by his... He's just going to put the puppies. He's going to put the bubbles. Gentle. Want to go play with your bubbles with the indigo? Want to go get some bubbles? Gentle, Landon. Come on, let's go outside. They are getting very fluffy. They are very, very fluffy and soft. You can also turn. Thank you. Carrie says, how often are you feeding them goat milk versus mama milk? They have access to mama milk whenever they want. 
um, more, I should rephrase whenever that. Lacey yes, they have like, access to Mama Milk whenever Lacey like. wants, um, which is not very often. Why don't you send her out? Hmm? Come on, Lacey. Um, Come on, Lacey. You just grab her collar, she'll go. Come on. Um, Lacey. So, uh, yeah, you don't listen to anything. Yeah, I mean, she's hardly feeding them at all. Like, we'll make her feed them at least two or three times a day. But oh. she's really... She she likes caring for them. She likes being around them. But she's really about had it with feeding them. Um, so, uh, you know. So th they're up to four times a day. <laughs> trying to climb into my lap, Chandler. That bubble thing is awesome. Whole store with bubbles over there. Hi, Chandler. Hi, Chandler. Uh, what temperament do they usually have registered for each puppy? Well, obviously, all dogs are, are individuals, and so um, a lot of it has to do Pete, with the individual puppy. But um, they don't usually um, you can put them on the pad or bring the pad closer if you want. Aww. Oh, my Rachel. She's looking my nose. Aww. Um, but both of the breeds, the Great um, Pyrenees and the Bernese Mountain Dog, Dog, are both called Gentle Giants, Aww. and so um, you know, just no just wonderful, like sweet, no. loving, no, um, very true. attached. Uh, you know that That's combination. The 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 Pyrenees tends to be a little bit more independent, mm -hmm. whereas the Bernese tends oh, to be a little bit more. Um, hi, Rachel. Are you trying to climb into my lap and go to sleep? Yeah, getting photos for you today was horrible. This um, guy was running all over the place. <laughs> Joey wouldn't sit still for his photos. No. She's licking the pedestal of the... Oh. You guys all tuckered out. <laughs> Rachel's passing out in my lap. She always does that. Hi. Hi, Joey. What, what, taking a nap what do I do with this, hmm? They didn't eat very much. I thought they'd eat oh, more. They, they eat this much. It was a, it was a decent amount of milk. Yeah, and and someone said not even the baby crying phases them, and that's exactly what we don't want them to be upset by any sounds, any noises. We do what's called habituation tapes, which is where it's different sounds like fireworks. Have they listened to the fireworks yet? Fireworks and dogs. I don't like the shrieking sounds, but yeah. I mean that. Um, the dogs barking and growling, thunderstorms. Um, they actually, there was a dog like uh, howling, and they didn't like that one. They they didn't react. They didn't like that sound. They don't like the uh, the howling, like the shrieking rockets. Um, they don't like high piercing sounds like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why don't you just get a sponge and wipe up around? We'll leave that for them to eat more. Yeah, we should eat, they'd eat more meat. Yeah, they definitely. Unfortunately, when I over think it, they never eat basically any meat because it all sinks to the bottom. I will let that sit in there for a little while. They'll come back in about an hour. You know, you guys probably can't see, but Rachel is just completely curled up in my lap. All right, well, I'm probably going to sign off because they're going to lick each other clean like those two are doing. And then they're going to take a nap. Three. And then they're going to take a nap. But you know what I can show you? If Rachel, you want to sit with Rachel and I'll go show them the... I don't know. She looks ridiculous. I know. She looks totally comfortable. Here, I'll take the photo. Take, okay, so... um. Go show them what Mason's doing in the wood fire oven. I don't know what he's doing. Right, well, never mind. We'll do it another time. She's just passed out. She's not actually asleep. So, yeah. So, the puppies are right on track doing everything we want them to be doing. Um, their uh, um, weight gain is is hard to balance up and down and up and down yeah. we want it to be around five percent a day um but it's it's hard when uh um lacy changes what she wants to do so often so we just kind of like try and balance out based on what lacy does um 
what is the link to see them again? So you can go to gmsdogs.com and then there's two links on the top. There's getting a puppy, which is all the information on um, the puppies, but they're, uh, does it say Lacey litter or May? Is this uh, May 2020. May 2020 litter? Pu May 2020 puppies. 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 In the top, and then you can. There's a link to all of yeah, the videos and their letters. individual pages. Um, chances, do you need someone to come and play with them? I volunteer. It is a tough job. Erin says Rachel's going to be so confused when my lap is too small for her. Doesn't bother Beckett. Beckett just climbs right on in. Mad Beckett never understood. She's like, yeah. "This is my home." Yeah. So my home is going she to... She still just climbs all over me. My home was sitting by the pool, so there was no spot for Becca to lie on her lap. And Becca was like, do, do I go in the pool so I can yeah. go on Mom's <laughs> lap? Do I... How do I deal with this? Yeah. She was so confused. Those two are awake. These two, Those three are awake. These two are sound asleep. Because they found more comfortable spots. Because <laughs> they found a lap to lie in. And a shoe to curl up high. <laughs> Chandler's just under my leg. Mason's cooking in the wood fired oven. What's for dinner? Um, uh, the pasta with vodka sauce and the leftover manicotti filling. And chicken, garlic chicken, and mushrooms, and would you grill my asparagus? And my asparagus. <laughs> are you eating outside or we're just gonna bring it back in? Monica is Monica's biting Joey's ear. She's like, oh. I was gonna say it probably feels good now. Yeah. And the bar is under the But somebody needs to wipe off all the stools. Um it was eighty degrees today, but we just had storms, so Mason said it's a lot cooler outside right now. I think we're gonna eat outside. We've been eating outside for like the past week and a half. So. Oh, now your baby Michael. I think it's hilarious we don't call the baby Michael because that's how we call the land in the bathroom. We still need to do the email today. Already done and sent. Who the best? Did you send the link for? I sent you a copy of it too, so you could see if I missed anything to put on next week's. You waking up? Thinking about it. I saw the first time today, yesterday, yesterday or today, where one of them, one of the puppies, bit the other puppy too hard, and they got mad. That was the first time I've seen. <laughs> Joey was on his back and Feedy was on top of him and he was like, ah. It was super funny. We were trying to take photos of Joey and I was like, dude, that, how, how do I. Who is that fighting over there? It's Monica. I was going to say Monica and I think Joey. Oh. Is it Phoebe? It's like it's Joey. Joey. Oh. Phoebe just curled up asleep. You are sleeping in my lap. Why are you crying? What are you here? Mom. So yeah, they're just... Oh, she got distracted. So they're just starting to get playful. Starting to interact more with toys. They've mostly just ignored them. So oh, now. It's all right. The Get a paper towel. Oh, that's a new one. Tanya says, I enjoy spending time with your family. It reminds me of the Waltons. What? Of the Waltons. <laughs> you missed the puppy pad. Are you going to knock Rachel out of her perch? <laughs> yes, I want to play with the, with the fiddle beepers. I think you probably need spray and one more paper towel on that. What? 
So I think you probably need spray and one, one more paper towel on that. It looks dry to Ow. me. Ow! 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 Sharp puppy nails! Uh. <laughs> Will Windex do? Will Windex do? Sure. Is it? You can put them on the front porch. You can put them on the puppy pad. It's a mass the spell. I mean the smell. I just said mass the spell. Yep, get that one up. Uh, yes, we cut their nails, Joanne. Hurry up before he steps on it. Hurry. There's nothing I can do. I don't have to pick that one. Just drop that one on it. This is not enough. I know, but I just meant maybe they wouldn't. You're gonna eat some more? <laughs> Scared her. You could also bring that puppy pad closer. I would help you know, except that I've got a puppy on my lap. Yeah. Well, <laughs> you would clean the floor with Windex. <laughs> Look what I have, Phoebe. Just bring the puppy pad closer. They're well, they're starting to use it. I've seen them a couple times go do it. And... I think that's just out of um, coincidence. <laughs> That they landed on the puppy bed, but... Oh, maybe. And yet, coincidence or not, it still landed on the puppy bed. <gasps> nah. look, look at her! <laughs> She's getting off. Oh, I'm gonna get it. It's actually gmsdogs.com slash puppy. gmsdogs.com slash puppy. She doesn't get it. Joey, come on. Be right on her. I think Phoebe's the best at it. I think Phoebe's the best at walking. Or uh -oh. maybe she's going on the carpet. No, Phoebe's got way too much sense that she's going to be able to do her dog was frightened of fireworks. Mm. Yes, you are, honey. Um, so what we do actually, um, yeah, Linda is, uh, we, we use tapes. So we actually, there's, there's what's on, on, um, uh, <laughs> online. <laughs> she was just sitting. Um, yeah, and it's yeah, actual yeah. fireworks. So that's what, if you, if you were listening earlier, I don't know when you joined, Jade was saying that they don't like the screeching fireworks. Um, but they seem to be okay with the pop pop fireworks. So yeah, so that's called it's called habituation, um, and you play the sounds for them so they get used to them and and uh, and don't don't get scared by them. You're back. Go get him! Go get him! Um, Lynn, visit gmsdogs.com slash puppy, and there's all information on there. I do not have a male puppy available from this litter. This litter is all spoken for. <laughs> Dance we're, floor. we're potty draining Landon, too, Brett, just so you know. Um, we're taking deposits on the next litter. Uh, we do have one from um, for a male for the next litter already, but just one. <laughs> what is she doing? She's not allowed it. Nope, 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 nope. Did you grab these? Watch it, watch it, watch it. Well, I'm trying to. Come on, Phoebe. It's just gmsdogs.com slash puppy no. singular. No. Just one puppy. No. I should probably. Brett, we should try and remember to change it to puppies to also forward to that page. Good. Yeah. No, she just she's lost her feet. All right, well, I'm going to sign off soon. Um, we have passed the vacuum cleaner test. They do not care about the vacuum cleaner sounds. I'll get the upright out probably tomorrow.
Um, this is the Roomba sound. And we didn't get scared by that. Yeah, don't put it in the... Just so you know, I have all the puppies are all here snuggled up with me. Except for Phoebe decided Phoebe, to take Phoebe a walk. Phoebe stays faithful. She's not very good in the car. Pull. Oh, you're welcome, Linda. And I mean, you can just pull up YouTube and, and you know, for firework sounds, but it's, there's, if you want the habituation, um, like you can actually look up, you know, yeah. YouTube habituation habit. U it's yeah, A T I O N. U A T I O N. Yeah. Um, there's actually a spray. Do you you don't have that spray that we got, do you? Do you remember what? Um I do. Uh it is well anyway, I'm sure. You could probably... I'll find it for you one time and show you. It, gentle, so basically gentle. it's a calming spray for dogs. Yeah, it smells um, like... It produces the, the pheromones that the, the mom produces for a calming effect. So when these guys get older and they start really fighting um, each other, you can use that and it's a calming. Yeah. Um, Go ahead and turn that off. Lori says, do the Bernese Mountain Dogs have a high prey drive that would make them unsuitable for LGDs? Um... Yeah. First of all, the LGD, um, which is Livestock Guardian Dog, um, the instinct doesn't kick in in full until two years old. He's trying to so his both of my dogs, both my Bernies, are younger than two, um, two years. And Mom. so Mom. their full instinct hasn't, and I don't know that I would ever trust a Bernese in the pen with the livestock. Um, just because they weren't bred for that. Um, we use the Bernese around the livestock um, and haven't had any trouble with them chasing or um, anything like that, but, but have kept them separated uh, by a fence line. So um, they weren't bred for that, so I don't know that I would, that I would feel comfortable, um, comfortable doing that. <laughs> Um, I'm guessing these guys are going to get to be 70 to 100 pounds. Um, they have from breed, you know, the breeds, they could be bigger than that. They could be 120, 115, but um, neither of their parents are, are on the large end for their breed. So I'm guessing a little lower, like 70 to 100. Um, now Beckett's, I would expect Beckett's puppies to get a little bit larger because Beckett's sire was huge. He was like 140 pounds. Um, You coming to say hi too? All right, time I'm taking that. <laughs> Just got milk all over Rachel and all over me. That's okay. I still love you. <laughs> and Jade is having fun playing with the dog toy. No. No. I show people your mask. I made myself a mask. I said it looks like um. Uh, Ow, puppy. The person in Star Wars. When you put it She's on. never seen people in uh, I don't own Beckett Sire. I don't remember his name. I'd have to look up her paperwork. I met him. Um, America. See what I mean, though? Ow! Um, Mom. Um, and then. Looks like that. Yeah. It does. Not the flowers. Okay. I was going to say, yeah, but the flowers. Watch her, watch her, watch her. Like so, Indigo's mask. All right, well, I'm going to sign off and go help Mason with dinner. We're having a yummy, yummy dinner. So, say goodbye, babies. Say goodbye, puppies. Go to sleep. You need your sleep. Where's the missing one? Behind me? No, it's not behind me. No, it's behind me. I counted the one on my lap as the one behind me that I can't uh -huh. see. Uh -huh. um, Cheryl says, will they make good service dogs? I personally believe they will make excellent. But we don't train um, for that. Service dogs. Uh, someday I do want to donate one to a service dog organization. Um, but 
Um, so that's my personal belief. Um, Becca is a full bred registered Bernie's Mountain Dog. So her, her sire was a Bernie's Mountain Dog. Oh my Mountain gosh, dog. Phoebes. So. Stop chasing after everything. She's trying to go under the under the chair. She can fit under there. Ugh. There is something under there. I have to move. Like it's our pill. Land the there. Shirt under there. Say goodbye, puppies. Yeah, they will see you tomorrow. But it's not like all the We'll see you tomorrow. Say goodbye. Say I'm so cute. Uh-huh.